Hello my peaches, what's up? I am Pratha and welcome to today's video. I promised myself that I will not buy more candles from Bath & Body Works until and unless I finish up my previous stock but looks like I again got tempted looking at those candles and I ended up buying a few, not too many, just a few. But in this video particularly, I'm going to talk about all winter candles that I have so that you can make up your mind and I can you know also suggest you a few things in here just in case you're curious about which ones to buy and which ones I was liking. Though what you can do is watch my store visit videos because in those videos I have really very actively talked about the candles i have visited the candle counters and smelled those candles and given my thoughts so that will be like more easy for you to make a decision which one to buy and which one not to buy depending upon whether you like my recommendations or not i highly suggest i will link all those videos up in the eye please watch them because it's never possible to cover everything in just one video until or unless i visit the store again with those thoughts let's quickly get into this video let's talk about these amazing candles and roll the intro Okay, so let's start with the old stock since I want to talk about them first and then move on to the uh, the new ones. The first one that I would like to talk about is Bright Christmas Morning. I absolutely love the packaging on this. It literally takes my heart every time I look at this candle. It literally smells like fresh, bright, fizzy, sweet, berry, apple -y, crispy kind of fragrance in here. I just love it to the core. This is my favorite candle, be it summers or winters, when it comes to making the house fragranted, but in a very fresh and crispy way. I mean, I can totally imagine a snowy morning, like a cold, snowy, fresh kind of morning. I can totally imagine that with this, but this is something you will not go wrong with, even if you burn it in the summertime and you try, you know, fragranting your house and making your house smell good with a candle like bright Christmas morning. This is your all year round candle in my personal opinion and I burn it all year round. I have used quite a lot of it. I mean yeah I've been burning it quite a lot lately. So yes um, that's bright Christmas morning and moving on to the next one. Next up I have Marshmallow Fireside. How can we not talk about this fragrance when we are talking about some winter fragrances? Marshmallow is like my favorite winter season note and let's read out the notes on it. It has the notes of toasted marshmallows, smoldering woods, fire roasted vanilla and crystallized apple. It has all the good things in here. Ugh, it's like your such a warm woody kind of sweet vanillic marshmallowy fragrance which is literally mouth watering which is literally so warm so cozy so beautiful if you don't want to go in the direction of super sweet fragrances but you still want something you know smoky woody and soft and sweet and warm at the same time marshmallow fireside has to be your candle for these winters this literally gives me very very cozy vibes evening vibes by the fireside having maybe some sweet and toasting some marshmallows in that fire and eating them hot oh my god my mouth is literally watering right now so if you are not into gomons but you still would want to have a very very warm and smoky woody kind of fragrance then this is something you must not miss out on and I just love it. I enjoy it quite a lot. This is one candle that I always burn whenever I am on my workstation and I am doing some editing. So this is the one that I always burn and I enjoy it quite a lot. Next up, I have Perfect Christmas Morning. If you pay a little attention to the packaging, it has... Uh, these Christmas trees all over and when this candle burns these Christmas trees light up and it looks super beautiful and the notes on this are fresh cut pine, cinnamon sugar, toasted marshmallow, just another toasted marshmallow fragrance but this does not come off as a true marshmallow fragrance. It mostly has this fresh pine note to it which is amazing which is like 
you're literally standing in the area where somebody is cutting fine trees and that greenness and that woodiness like the fragrance and the smell of freshly cut wood along with those leaves is coming with some soft spiciness which is coming from cinnamon and the cinnamon done in this one because what happens is that i love cinnamon note but if it is not done right or if it is not done in the proper amount i do not like it so perfect christmas morning is a fragrance that has the right amount of cinnamon in it which does not get on my nerves and which is not overpowering it is just kind of you know supporting the fragrance by giving it this soft spiciness which is absolutely not off putting for me and i can handle this kind of cinnamon and then we have to soften it we have the marshmallow which is not exactly making a sweet fragrance but it's just kind of adding a softness and a smoothness to the entire thing and so woody warm and green at the same time and i have i think this is one candle that i have burnt the most and i am um, no this one and there's another one so i have burnt these two the most this makes my house smell so good this is one candle which is always in my living room and whenever anybody is about to come to the house i make sure to burn this candle or in general like even if even if nobody is coming in the winter days when fans are off because we do not experience too much of a winter in hyderabad but when we have fanless days i make sure to burn this candle in the living room and it just fills the room like literally fills the room with its fragrance we have a decent like a quite a big size of living room and it literally fills the room it in fact fills the house with its fragrance so it's quite potent quite out there but it is so amazing another green woody fragrance that i love quite a lot is under the christmas tree i like that candle so much and i was almost planning on buying that last year but it was on full price it was not on discount and that's why i stopped myself and did not buy it but yes whenever it comes in stock and whenever it is on sale prices i will make sure to grab that one because i love that quite a lot and now moving on to the gomond fragrances you know me i am a gomond lover and i cannot do without if there is fragrance involved the majority has to be of gomonds so the first one that i'm going to talk about is pumpkin pecan waffles and the condition of this candle clearly tells you that i have burnt this the most and this has been my go to yummy bakery like and true gomond candle it has the notes of maple syrup golden waffles pumpkin spice and brown sugar this is literally just a through and through a warm sugary fragrance in here with a cake like feel to it with a bakery like feel to it and it is so potent that it literally fills the room with its fragrance and it is so strong that whenever i keep it beside my uh, bedside table or somewhere else so wherever it is kept it just keeps you know throwing its fragrance at you even when you're not burning it so if it is just kept there and you you do not even have the lid open you have the lid on even then it has the potential of giving off its fragrance throughout the day so it's kind of this subtle fragrance in that particular room wherever this candle is kept so i really like that about this but otherwise as well i just love this true bakery like super sugary warm kind of fragrance it is my candle whenever i am reading a book whenever i am in the mood of some me time or i am just you know i want to feel cozy that is when i burn this candle and i have burnt it quite a lot i am half ways down with this one that is why i felt the need of buying more gourmands in candles so yeah that is what is the new stock is all about and let's talk about that stock now so among the new candles the first one that i bought is paris cafe i had no candle which had a coffee note to it i have been a coffee lover all my life but now i've been unable to drink coffee because i have 
kind of become caffeine sensitive and whenever i drink too much of caffeine it keeps me awake for two days so coffee is something i just cannot have tea is something i take in moderation and always take it before noon so that i do not end up facing trouble with my sleeping cycle so yes if i cannot have coffee at least i can burn a candle that makes my house smells like coffee so for that reason i bought paris cafe it has the notes of rich roasted coffee sugared brioche and vanilla creme it literally smells like a cafe in here it smells like somebody is making a lot of coffee it's sweet it's creamy it's like tonic and it's coffee like it's literally like you're digging your nose in a cappuccino this that is what it smells like and this is the only candle that i have burned till now in the new stock and i've been loving this like this also has the potential of filling a like a medium sized room with its fragrance for hours even when it goes off the fragrance lingers and it keeps on going and i love that about it because i love the coffee fragrance in my room so yes this has been my you know bedside table a candle these days and i've been burning it quite a lot so i think this is just another fragrance that i'm going to go crazy over these winters because i've been craving some coffee like since i can't drink it and since i can't have it at least i can burn it when i was buying this coffee fragrance i was going through some other candles as well i think i had my eyes on blueberry pecan waffles if i'm not wrong uh, i might be getting the name wrong but that is one fragrance i was really interested in and there was a candle named peppermint chocolate chip cookies so that was really making me curious another candle that i tried in the store and fell for instantly was hot chocolate peppermint so that's one amazing chocolatey and that mix of peppermint and chocolate milk it's yummy i mean it might sound like weird combination but somehow it just smells yummy so if you are looking for something like that you can definitely look into these candles and another yummy bakery like fragrance is sugared snickerdoodle which is just not worth missing out on so if it comes in sale in a single wick candle i'll probably pick that one up because i also need space to store these candles you know let's talk about the next one and after a lot of putting things in the cart and taking them out i decided on buying iced lemon pound cake because i wanted a gourmand that i can burn in these summers as well and this sounded like something which i would love a lot it has the notes of sugary glazed icing pure lemon zest fluffy pound cake and whipped cream all the good things in here and it is is so yummy it's mouth watering it's the perfect balance of that lemony zestiness along with that soft sweet fluffy cake like fragrance i think this is something which is so appropriate to be burning in winters as well as in summers if you love your gourmands that much because i love my gourmands a lot so i definitely am going to burn this all year round and it's yummy guys oh it's making my mouth water like anything so yes it's great it's fresh it's cake like it's soft it's sweet it's yummy i just cannot wait to burn this i think this is going to be my you know workstation candle for sure now and the last one that i picked up was cookies with santa i mean i was definitely looking into sugared snickerdoodle but then i picked up this one because this was giving me more of those christmas eve vibes with the name and as well as the packaging it literally has the uh you know christmas decorated fireplace on it which is beautiful and has holographic sheen to it the notes on this are fresh cinnamon brown sugar a drop of vanilla this is just another warm cinnamony fragrance which i am not minding at all again the cinnamon in this is done really really well i have tried a few candles in bath and body works which are cinnamon based and the cinnamon is so overpowering so strong that i could not handle it 
but I'm so glad that the cinnamon in this one is again done really well. Just another candle that I have not burnt till now, but yes, just cannot wait. I think this is going to be inaugurated on the Diwali day or maybe on a day before. So, uh, this is just another mouth-watering kind of soft, spicy, cookie-like vanillic fragrance, which is amazing, which is sweet, which is great. And I just cannot wait to burn this one again. So that's my haul for candles this year. I might buy a, a few more, like maybe one or two, not too much because then I'll run out of space to store them. But I just cannot wait to celebrate my festivities and this festive season and this winter season with these candles. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to give this video a big fat thumbs up down below. Leave some festive emojis or some winter emojis in the comments section. Let's make it colorful. Let's make it beautiful. I will see you in the next one. Till then, keep looking beautiful. Keep smelling good. Happy festivities, you guys. Have a great day all. Bye-bye. Mwah.